What is going on, guys? Clutch Squad 4 and 5 here. Finally back with another Minecraft video. It's been a while. Uh, I think the last one was episode 20. Just been pretty preoccupied with ghosts and everything going on. But we're back, finally. Back on the server. It's been a while. Remember last time we were trying to enchant some stuff. Trying to get a fortune pickaxe because we got the, uh, the mine down there. I finally added a door to this and left it in the comments that I should probably have a door on that since all my storage is in here. Um, did enchant another weapon. I mean, another pickaxe. But I got this on it, which is actually pretty good. Efficiency 4 and I'm breaking 3. I think I had like 33 levels on it. So that's over 2. We got efficiency 3 on this one. I'm just going to burn through that. It's not that important. Um, go strip mining. Definitely keep this. Just trying to... Uh, get a fortune pick that's our goal right now and with the new settings I'm a little bit confused um, render distance 12 chunks yeah my frame rates dropping a little bit I don't know what even view bobbing means to be honest with you guys brightness bright particles all Minimap levels, what does that mean? I'm trying to do something here to see why I would be having a little bit of frame rate issues. Oh, all my cords are mixed up. I don't know if it has to do with the max frame rate. If that has anything to do with it. What's down here? Alright, I think we might be good. It just seems a little bit laggy, but I think we'll get through it. Hopefully it's not too laggy on the... Uh, the other side okay so what I was gonna do is uh, really boring I was gonna actually strip mine for a while it is actually very boring to do even more boring to watch but it's necessary for diamonds like the first little batch we found here which was so weird I was just turn the corner right there for diamonds I actually didn't check on top Nah, okay. So maybe I'll just go this way. Probably going to be really hard to find diamonds since we found some so close. Because, I mean, like, it's so rare to find them that close to, like, where you start mining. But, maybe I'll start this way. And this is really the main purpose for this. It's just because a lot of people say, like, oh, you could have got those uh, diamonds off camera and just planted them through creative. But I'm going to show you guys all the processes of getting diamonds and if I do get them. And even if it takes, like, hours upon hours and I have to fast forward through the entire thing just to have the footage to show you guys. But right now, this is not looking good with all this dirt. Hopefully, it's not too dark on the other side of the recording. This is also a really good way to get cobble, if you didn't know. Yeah, I think like our cobblestone chest was really low before. I'm not sure why, I think it was when I built the bridge. It took up a lot of uh, cobblestone, and I have a shovel, I'm not using it. Yeah, I think I used a lot of cobble on that bridge. So this is a good way to collect some more, in case we want to build something. I'm thinking about building a castle and a tree house. Just to, you know, spice up this server a little bit because no one's really been on it in a while since Ghost came out and the Xbox One's about to come out. And I've been playing a lot of GTA. So hopefully we can all get back on this server. Matt's computer is fixed. So he'll be on this. Noodle Squad. Ooh, Emerald. Um, don't know if I should mine that right away. I think I will because I don't really use Emerald that much. Yeah, I'll just mine it. Not really of use to me, but we'll take it. Yeah, so, basically just going to be strip mining here for a while. I might not, um, I might like, uh, what you gonna call it. Like, I'll do this entire thing, and I'll fast forward through it in the video, uh, if I even find anything. I think we might just collect this stuff here too. 
just to have some more coal on the server. Because I was thinking if I had a lot of coal or not. And I think I'm actually running low on coal. And my torch is running low, which is not good. And that's my cat meowing. One second, guys. Let me go get it. Oh my gosh, my cat's biting on the mic. That's bad. Okay. We're back. Okay, now we're back. Redstone. Don't have a lot of redstone on this. Server. Redstone, I think, is another one you can use with fortune. That's good. You get a lot. This stone pick is so slow, but I don't really want to waste. You know, I actually don't need this one. I'll use it. And we'll hop down and get this. Oh my gosh. Uh, this is also another good way of getting levels, instead of, you know, just sitting at the mob trap for hours upon hours, which is always good because mob trap does generate a lot of XP. It's just good sometimes to do this, spice things up. How far am I? Not that far. But, let's continue going. So basically, what I'm going to be doing until we get the fortune pickaxe is just like, Mining through, and if I find diamonds, I'll leave them. Just because I don't want to mine them right now without a fortune pick. Because you can really multiply like your diamond uh, count by a lot with fortune. So basically, if I find something, I'll leave it in the cave. Most likely remember where it is, and then come back with the fortune pick. And why is there so much dirt? I think I chose to do it on a level 12. I'm pretty sure I chose level 12. We'll find out. If I can remember, I think it's like F3. Is it F3? Yes, okay, 12. Level 12. Should have bought more picks. Brought more picks with me. What's on this pick? I have no clue what efficiency means. Is that, I think that means that it breaks blocks faster because this thing is tearing through the blocks right now. And I think that unbreaking is obviously unbreaking. Uh, you can have it for longer. Silk touch on a pick lets you actually like mine the block. So if I had redstone there, I would mine the redstone block, not the actual uh, mineral. And that's done with that pick. And then what are some other ones? Fortune gives you more fortune just like looting on a sword um, but fortune's really hard to come by in fact I think it's like I don't know if silk touch is more rare than it but I think fortune's one of the rarest uh, enchants you can get on a pickaxe so it takes like a while to get it you'd be really lucky if you get it in like your first uh, enchantment like that's what I was hoping for but I knew going in that I wasn't going to get it. Probably won't get it for a while. But, you know, once you do get it, it's a pretty uh, good surprise and a uh, prize, basically. And I was trying to, like, I don't really want to get it on my diamond pick. Because, like, I didn't want to enchant my diamond pick right now. Because, like, if I did... And I ended up getting something stupid like efficiency 4 on it. And you can't like take that off. I don't know. I kind of wouldn't want that. So I'm going to save all these levels right now for looking for a fortune. If I do get it, then we'll uh, keep that iron pick strictly for mining diamonds and minerals and loots and stuff like that. But after we get that, try to get another really high level enchant. But this time put it on my diamond pick. Try to get like unbreaking or something like that. Maybe unbreaking efficiency and something special. Silk touch would be cool, but I mean, I don't really need a silk touch pickaxe. 
I don't really know what you'd use it for. Like, what do you need the silk touch for? I know it's fun to like play around with like ice blocks and stuff like that. Wow, this is uh getting me a lot of coal. And I think we ran through this entire iron pick, which is kind of disappointing. Ten level, ooh, loppies. Loppies, literally, the only thing I use loppies for is just like getting blue blocks and putting them in my house. That's the only thing I use it for. And if there's like a blue sheep, or I want to get a blue sheep for some blue wool, you can just make the dye with that. But other than that, it's pretty useless. It's nothing compared to like redstone with what you can do with it. Maybe in a future update they'll make something with lapis lazuli. It's fine to say. We have drifted far off. I think I'm gonna go until this pick breaks. Which will be pretty soon. We got one more torch. I really don't know how far you're supposed to go in one direction. I've gone pretty far, I think. We'll just go until this breaks. Oh, redstone and it broke. Alright. We have a lot of redstone, actually. Okay. So, we're all the way over here. Let me see. Oh, I was thinking if I should mark the coordinates, but I don't think it's really necessary. And I'm going to run back. I don't know if you guys knew this, but if you're running in a two block, oh, is that iron? Ooh, missed it. Um, if you guys are running in a two block high area and you continuously press spacebar to hit your head, you actually go faster than just straight running. You do lose a lot of hunger bars, as you guys can see. I just lost a shit ton, but we are back. It's a good thing I keep a lot of food on me. Okay, so we went pretty far in that direction. I'd probably continue that way, just because it would suck if you were, like, so close. And, like, if you break one more layer, there's diamonds, but, like, you never break that layer. You just quit and go back. So probably keep going that way. And if there's other people on the server, we can all mine at the same time. Uh, just to like multiply the diamond count and then fortune pickaxe would be like like the good thing about a fortune is with, if you're with a lot of people let's say someone just finds a vein of like two diamonds with a normal pickaxe you get two diamonds um, and let's say there are three people you can't really split that but with the fortune pickaxe you could basically I think you could get even six diamonds out of just two veins which would be sick because you could divide like your diamonds, then each piece, each person would get two instead of one person not getting any before, so that's the good thing about it. You get a lot more loot. That was a good way to get some cobblestone there. Got some dirt, which is useless. Um, put the iron in there. And the coal. Okay, so I was wrong. We did have a lot of coal. I'm going to make these into some uh, torches. Put the loppies up there. Put the emerald downstairs, I think. First, I need some sticks. I think I only need six. Just make all these torches. Up here. Alright, 40 torches. That'll last a while. What am I going to be using right now? This pick? And just trying to organize my hot bar. This does not need to be in it. What is this doing? Okay. I don't know why I never mind that. I guess it's just cool to have. I can go there. And I got this, if you guys didn't know. An Aqua Infinity and Protection 1 cap. From, uh, the mob's trap. Okay. So how long has this been recording? 14 minutes of just, uh, straight, uh, what's it called? Strip mining. So I'm probably going to go to sleep right now. I might make this a long episode just because there hasn't been one in a long time. Look at that creeper outside my door. Skeleton. 
Do spiders attack during the day? I forgot. No, they do not. Oh, yeah, they do. Yeah, they. Oh, I thought they don't. I was always sure that skeletons don't. Oh my god, there's a lot of mobs. I was almost positive that they didn't attack during the day. And I know creepers don't. Creepers do attack during the day. I thought it's oh, a little bugger over there. I'm just looking for arrows right now. All right, let's head back. And possibly, uh, I think I'm going to throw some stuff in the furnace. Or the furnace is downstairs. That was a bad lag drop right there, frame rate drop. It's lagging still. I don't know why. I tried to organize this little thing right here. Some string up there. Um, all right, so what do I have to cook? A lot of beef. Some pork. 51 potatoes. Anything else to cook? Oh, some iron. I think I can smelt that up. And some gold. That should be good. I still haven't got these on my horse. I don't know. I didn't show you guys the horses that I have that are over there. And I did find some extra name tags, so I named them uh, some pretty good names. I'll show you guys that after. I don't know why, but in the, uh, the Nether Fortress, I did not know this, but there's actually chests in the Nether Fortress that are like supposed to have 10 times the loot of like the uh like any uh what you call it because a lot of the time when you're in like a abandoned mine shaft you'll get a lot of good loot and supposedly these things have even way more loot uh in the nether fortresses i guess they have chests now like there's mazes and stuff so i got all this stuff just from that a lot of gold i already used two of the gold chest plates this one's pretty worn down uh, i used three of the saddles and I think I got two diamonds from it. I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, two diamonds. But I'm not going to really use those. Okay, so. I'm going to go cook up all this stuff. I don't really want to use the diamond horse armor. I don't know why. <laughs> I want to save it. Alright. Let's throw that in there. Throw that in there. That in there. And we'll waste some coal and throw this in nowhere. Ooh, that's not going to be enough. Put that in there. So you have another one, just in case it runs out. Alright, I have not... I don't even know why... I, whoa, what's with the frame rate dropping? I forgot I even had this little swimming pool thing. Kind of stupid, kind of cool. Just from the old, you know. Okay, this lag's really bothering me. Just memories from the old uh, house. I guess I can collect this stuff and go mate the animals. Did I break that by accident? Yeah. Okay, this frame rate. Frame rate drops. Random ones, too. Um, 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 I just collected this last time I was on the server. Put this away. Maybe make some more bookshelves. But definitely going to go mate these buggers. Do I have sheep? I don't think I have sheep on this server. Which is bad. These for chicken. Okay, seriously, what's going on with the frame rate drop? Whoa, that's weird. That's really weird. What is that? Okay, we're going we're going normal. Video settings. Render distance. Let's go nine chunks. Is nine chunks good? If I can see the Batman thing, I'll be happy with it. Oh, nine chunks. Oh. Alright, it's all loading in. Oh, this feels smoother, actually. 
Except I think I might have been on nine chunks like two seconds ago, but I just forgot. Okay, that, that, this seems better as of now. And I see that guy right there. Hey, what you doing over there, buddy? I don't want to go fight him. I actually don't want to. Uh-oh. He's mad. Oh, got team. All right. Bows are so OP. OP. I have no sheep on this server. That's disappointing. Okay. That's a lot of chicken. Let's see how many eggs we get. I think I might have needed more than eight seeds. We'll find out. Spam the seeds. Here we go. I'm going to leave these guys in here. It's so inhumane, but... Oh, that guy's forever alone. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. That makes no sense, though. Unless someone had a threesome. I don't know. I don't want to talk about it. Okay, not a lot of cows. Disappointing. Make a baby. Yeah, buddy. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Did I get the XP? Okay. And pigs, as far as I know, they eat carrots. I think they eat carrots. Do they eat carrots? Yes. Spam and carrots. Okay. Let's get in there. You guys need to get to each other. They're meant for each other. They can't make it. There we go. Little baby. Alright. Let me get out of here. Next time I'll kill like half of those. These guys need to really repopulate. Okay, and the foggy thing over there is kind of bugging me. It's up the render distance. The 10 chunks. I don't know how much a chunk is. Armor's looking pretty good. Okay. Back. Yeah. Uh, if it'll load, I think it's good. Yeah. Right, it's not that foggy stuff anymore. Cat, why are you so weird? Okay. It's been about 23 minutes. Wow. 23 minutes of doing basically nothing. I'm going to put this stuff away. Oh, I didn't put the potatoes in the uh, thingy. Stupid me. I'm going to put the wheat away. Um, gunpowder, some bones there, and some eggs. Okay, what am I doing? Okay, going to the kitchen. I'm going to put the uh, potatoes in. I'm going to put a half of them in, I think. It's a lot of steak. Take that gold. The iron, nothing in there, and some pork chops. All right, 15 levels, not that bad. Put this back. Um, and put these potatoes back, and these pork chops, half the steak back. The ores back and it's lagging again. 
gosh, why is this happening? Maybe it's because I'm playing on full screen. I don't know. I'll try out next episode not playing on full screen. Oh, okay. So, for the end of the video, I'm going to tell you guys what we're doing next video, which is I want to build a castle. And I think I'll build it, like, right here. Seems like a good place, too. But... I'll also build a tree house, I'll try to build a sick one, and last but not least, I'm going to show you guys, inside the secret hideout, the horses. You guys may have seen me run past here before, you may have not, but in here, we got horse, in here, did I name this guy? What's your name? No, he just got a chest on him. How do I left shift? Left shift. I think I need to hold shift and then click him. Yeah, and then you can get into the uh, the chest there. There's a little, I think you have to do with a mule before. We got Ricky Rose, a.k.a. Rick Ross, with that gold boss armor. And we got Dale Doe back from Step Brothers. So, next time, we probably will be using one of these guys. But for now, I'm going to end the video here, and I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, look forward to the next episode. I'm going on a freaking grind right now, making straight videos so I can post them during the week. Um, I, might up, I might upload like a room setup video after the Xbox One comes out because I'm ordering like a new desk right now and uh, some new office supplies and stuff like that, tables and stuff, just to, you know, make this setup a lot better than what it is right now and that might be a future video definitely gonna build something cool what is that right there is that a, it's a witch what what is going on right now what is this what am I poisoned with I'm so confused guys am I supposed to kill the witch Get back, fool. I kind of want to bring this witch inside. Am I supposed to kill the witch? Why is there a witch here? I'm so confused. Where'd it go? No, get away. Why is it four hits? Where did this bitch go? Oh shit, there it is. Why is this guy full armor? Now I'm poisoned. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Come in. Come in. Come in. I feel like I'm supposed to kill it. Oh, it's one of the villagers is poisoned. God damn it, this bitch is pissing me off. Come in. Come in! I want her to come in and I want to... Okay, close my doors. Okay, okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Don't worry. I'm gonna die. Okay. I don't know what to do. I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to research. Oh, I got that. I'm going to research what to do with a witch. That would be so sick if I could keep her trapped inside my house. I kind of want to do that right now badly. Oh, shit. She could leave with that. Uh... What's up, buddy? Okay. So I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to see what you do with a witch. Kill it. It can drop, like, potions and shit. I don't want it to de- I want to, like, keep it, but I don't know if it'll despawn, so I'm just killing it, if I can kill it. If I die from this witch, I'm going to be pissed. Alright. Did it even drop anything? Whoop-de-fucking-do, it didn't even drop anything. 
That was the most anticlimactic freaking. Holy lag. That was so, like... I was, like, so pumped. Okay, this lag is really bad. I'm going to research why I'm lagging, too. But, it's going to be the end of that video. Um, a lot of XP out here. That was weird. I thought witches have to be in their witches' huts. But, I guess not. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Look forward to the next one. Going to be making a castle, I think. And, uh... Peace, guys. Thanks for watching.